five weeks after my shows and I am in improvement season now. Later, I'm going to do DEXA body fat scans. I believe last time I did it, it was 2017. So I want to know what is my lean body mass now and my body fat percentage. I'm not gonna say it's 100% accurate, but it gave me a general ideas on my lean body mass. And I'm gonna just have a light workout today because if I really, really push myself, for example, if I do shoulder today, if I really, really push myself during the workout and later if I do the DEXA scans, it may show my shoulder will have a bigger muscle group which is not what I want. I want to keep everything normal, consistent, and I'm still drinking my one gallon water. Usually I finish one gallon before noon. So food-wise, I'm still gonna eat the same. I'm not gonna cut or eat too much because I want a reliable result. And probably next time, if I do it again, I will still do it in the afternoon because this time, I'm going there in the afternoon. So I'm gonna have like a very light shoulder workout today and then head out soon in the afternoon. I'll see you guys later. Just finished my workout and I'm making my Mewtwo, cooking more vegetable for the week. And then after my Mewtwo, which is my lunch, I will head out to the DEXA Skin Centers and I can't wait to share with you guys the results. But before that, I wanna show you what is my typical post shows, not post show, what my typical improvement season's lunch looks like. Lunch today is this asparagus, some lettuce, and then I have cooked salmon and rice. And I will put a little bit of the sesame oil with the rice. It tastes amazing. And I just chop off this asparagus and just pan fried it. Also, I'm measuring my rice here. And then I will also put some letters, shredded letters, a little bit pan fried. It tastes much, much better. Right, Mama? Ta da! Sometimes I just stir fry it and mix it up, and I don't separate fish, rice, veggie. It's just a simple meal. And I also top with some hot sauce. This is truffle hot sauce. It tastes a little bit on a more like a sweet size. It's not bad, but it's just so-so. But I still like it. I also got this mustard sauce with five gram sesame oil. I love to put it in the rice. It just tastes much, much better. Oh, and yourself. And I also gonna have this BCAA. I got this flavor Mango Madness. Honestly, this is a good brand and it dissolves in water really well and it tastes very smooth. And I also put some creatine. I find creatine has been really, really helpful on my recovery. I feel less fatigued after workout. So I put it in my BCA. And yeah, that's my meal too. Next meal is this protein shake because I am heading out. I need something quick and fast. I'll bring this protein shake with me. This is a really, really good flavor. I also like their cinnamon toast crunch cereal flavor. Seriously, that one. Let me see if I can find that one. Okay, yeah. So this is also my favorite because I feel like I'm just drinking the cereal. It's so good. All right, about to head out now. So I'm here. This is the truck, and I'm gonna go in now. Your shoes off, and then your head that way, your back, and head. On your back, and your head. You. Mm -hmm. On your back. Come down. Right, perfect. Arms straight out, legs straight. Arms straight out, palms facing in. 
palms facing in, karate chop hands like this. Yep. Bring your arms in for me a little bit. Okay, not that much. Right there. But I don't want you to curve your wrist. I want you to just straight. Yep. Perfect. Toes pointed up. Yep. Bring your legs in a little bit. Yep. Mm -hmm. Bring your arms in a little bit. Yep. Okay, no more moving, okay? Okay, any chance you're pregnant? No. Okay. Here we go. Your birthday. talk about the body fat DEXA scans result. The whole process only took 10 to 15 minutes and this time they didn't um, go over the results with me but they said I can schedule a virtual consultations online and then also they don't provide printed copy and they just emailed it to me. So I have it here and I'm going to share with you. Actually, I am pretty, pretty happy about the results. First of all, my last time, the first time that I did it, it was 2017, February 20. At the time, I didn't really, really know what training is, but I go to the gyms like once a week and 90% cardio focus. I haven't even started my prep yet. So my first prep is started back in 2018. And then at the time, at 2017, my body fat was at 28.3%. Total mass is 107.1 pounds. And then the fat tissues is 30.4 pounds. Lean body mass, lean tissue is at 72.9. And bone mineral content is at 3.9. And today, July 12th, my body fat is at 17%. Total mass is at 103.6 pounds. Fat tissues is at 17.7. <coughs> fat tissues is at 17.7 pounds. And lean tissues, I think this is my muscle gains, 81.7 pounds. This is my muscle tissues and bone mineral also increased to 4.3. I am really, really happy about this result because my fat tissue back in the day is 30.4 and today I'm at 17.7. Five weeks out post shows. If I did it right after the show, the body fat tissue will be much, much lower. But this time I chose four or five weeks after the show to do it because I want to see what my body fat looks like when it comes to like a normal, normal time. For example, when I'm in improvement seasons and when I keep a little bit higher body fat but not like stage lean because I personally think keeping stage lean is not healthy around the year because your body need a rest. So I want a more reliable results. So that's how I wait like four or five weeks after the shows to do it. And I'm really, really happy. Very happy. It's like all the gains and all the works, all the cardio, all the trainings that I put in. It's totally worth it. I'm not gonna tell you how easy it is. I'm not gonna tell you how difficult it is, but I'm gonna tell you it's gonna worth it. And also I found out my resting metabolic rate increase, which made me so, so happy because um, in the past, last time it shows is 1,099 calories a day. This is basically like me doing nothing, just laying in bed, that is the calorie. And then this time my calorie RMR bump up to 1,181 calories a day. And this is why I find out I can eat more without gaining weight now. Back in the day, if I eat over, let's say like 100, I remember it's around 100 back in the day. If I eat over 100 carbs, my weight would just bump up like a week. I was just living like a skinny fat lifestyle. If I eat a little bit carbs, then my weight will just go up a lot, a lot, the next day, the next week. 
and we just hold on. But this time, I'm eating like almost 200 grams carbs. I said 190 grams carbs on my refeed days, and my weight didn't really, really go up a lot. And that's why I feel like, hmm, maybe my RMR increased. And it is, and I'm very, very really happy. If you are also interested in DEXA scans, some tips here for you, and take notes. First one is, on the day that you go there, try to make sure to take off your watch, and necklace, jewelry, and try to wear a comfortable clothes, and because you have to lay down there. And then this time, they didn't provide printed copy. I think maybe it's due to the pandemic and also they don't provide uh, consultations. But um, the lady told me I can schedule a virtual consultations online, which is really, really good. And she also offered me a $25 deal for next time. And the time, will, the credits will not expire. Personally, I think it's a little bit like a sales because after she helped me, she told me um, to cancel the memberships. Um, and I was like, wait, 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 wait. This is a uh, monthly subscriptions because I didn't know that. All I heard from her is just, do you want a $25 credit for next time for this scans? And then I was like, oh, okay. And then after she helped me and she told me, um, just remember if you don't like the membership, you can cancel it anytime and at the time, she already charged my car and then I knew it's like a monthly subscription, which I'm not mad at it, but I would appreciate if business like that, they should always be honest, do the right things and do things right to the customers. This is the most important things I think for all the business, how they run their business. This is the most important things when it comes to customer service and building up a business. I always believe transparencies and do the right things and do things right for the customer is always, always the key. Out of battery now. I gotta get out now. I will see you next time. Bye. And this is my meal five. I'm gonna have some cereal, everything mix a little bit. And then this is my favorite cinnamon cereals from Boma Nutritions and it just feels like this is literally you're drinking the cereal. So I'm gonna put in this big bowl and the reason I chose this because it's standard steel and it can keep the temperature. It keeps my protein shakes cold. So definitely gonna respect my protein shake. Mm. Cereals that I use has three wishes. Cinnamon flavor is the best. Of course, more cinnamon toast crunch. And then these ones. I like to have everything little. This is my new five.